Editing is easy. Oh yeah, let's add the camera then. Um, still easy. Another one. Still easy. <laughs> How about five more? You're really pushing it, bro, you know? But still easy, let me explain. Multi-camera has been a crucial technique like forever. It's commonly used in reality TV, documentaries, live shows, dance performances, TikTok videos. Okay, okay, man, we get it, it's common. Working with multiple cameras can seem intimidating. You might think that you have to sync and align all your clips, select your angles, do a ton of cutting while trying to not go insane with a huge pile of flares in your timeline. <laughs> Unless you edit in Filmora 14, let me show you how simple it is. In your media folder, select all the camera angles, right click on them and select create a multi-camera clip. For the synchronization method, let's do audio since all the cameras share the same one and you will see a multi-camera clip appear in your timeline. Then let's switch to multicam view by clicking on this icon and now you can see all the angles available. As you play the video, simply click on desired angle and the adjustment on your timeline will happen automatically. Just like a real life show. Besides the fact that if in a moment you made a mistake, just go back to the clip, select a different angle and it will replace it for you. But what if I have only one camera? No problem, just shoot one wide shot, preferably in 4K. Put it on your timeline and duplicate it as many times as many angles you want to have. In my case, I will have wide shot and three coverage angles for every character. Change the scale and position on every clip, select all of them, right click and, you guessed it, create a multicam clip. And now you can edit your videos like 516 times faster, which is great. How about a dance match cut sequence? Just film the same dance moves with the same framing on different locations, create a multicam sequence out of them and simply cut them on the beat. It's just a few ways how this tool could be used, but feel free to explore it and see how you could implement it in your own personal workflow. And don't forget to let us know in the comments. As always, it's been a pleasure to preach the knowledge to you. If you liked the video, please consider to like and subscribe for more awesome videos on our channel. Keep creating and I will see you next time.